Hey guys, it's Mr. AJ's Tech here, and today I'm going to be showing you the iPhone 5 versus the 4S camera. So right here is a snapshot on the iPhone 5, the close-up some rocks. Uh, the biggest thing I notice in the difference in quality is color. Uh, you can see right here from these two photographs that uh, the iPhone 5 will look better with the color. Uh, so overall, I noticed that the iPhone 5 camera, uh, it does look better. The 4S is no shame, uh, but the iPhone 5 will give you some better snapshots. Uh, right here, we're just looking at some swing set. Uh, and again, the, the reason why there's black space is because these are the native resolutions of these pictures. I didn't want to crop in because uh, that would kind of lose it. Uh, but this is the iPhone 5. The previous picture was the 4S. And uh, you can see that the, the quality does look good. The color looks pretty, pretty decent on the iPhone 5. Uh, overall, I'm pretty impressed. I can't wait to take some real uh, photographs of this. Uh, this is just my backyard. And this one right here is the 4S. I noticed that depth of field uh, where you have the... Uh, the focus, uh, the out of focus in the back and the, the object in front in focus, uh, it was very easy to do on the iPhone 5. It took me a while to get that last picture with the 4S. Uh, so this is the iPhone 5. It's very easy to get these nice close-up shots in the background out of focus. Uh, so I definitely like that about the iPhone 5. And the following clips will be of the video of the cameras. So we are recording. Uh, this is with a 4S and a 5. Uh, so we're just looking at an outdoor test of the 1080p quality, looking at 4S versus the iPhone 5, of course. Uh, so yes, uh, we're also testing audio. Of course, the new iPhone 5 has that uh, three microphones. And we're just looking around. This is a pretty, pretty much daylight test. We're looking up, look out, and you can see that the quality looks pretty uh, pretty good on the iPhone 5. Uh, the 4S is no uh, shameful in video recording, uh, but obviously the 5 will uh, serve you better. This is front-facing camera on the 4S. Looking around very quickly. And this is the front-facing camera on the 4S. This is the front-facing camera on the iPhone 5. I can tell right away that it does look pretty decent. Uh, we're just going to go kind of circle around and see. Uh, it does look pretty good. Probably. So overall, within the first uh, day of uh, the iPhone 5, I've noticed that the biggest difference in terms of camera is the front-facing camera. Uh, the front-facing camera looks so much better, especially compared to, of course, the iPhone 4S VGA resolution. Of course, that, that 720p will fill the full video aspect, where the other one will not. So I'm very impressed with the front camera. I uh, haven't tried this with FaceTime. I don't know how well that will work, uh, but uh, definitely, definitely awesome uh, upgrade in the front camera. The back camera will look good. Uh, of course, you'll uh, being in like a better place, let's say full light, uh, it's like water shots, kind of like that. Uh, you will see a difference in terms of the iPhone 5 rear camera, but I really see the big difference in terms of the front facing camera. So if you enjoyed this video, be sure to rate, comment, and subscribe, and I'll see you next video. Bye-bye.